So some may not know this about you, but you've worked in higher ed your entire working life. Uh, you've been at the University of Arkansas, Montana State Billings, and Shatter State College. What do you, so you kind of have a unique insight into this question, but what do you see as, as the challenges for higher education in the next decade? Well, I think it kind of goes back to that, my comment earlier about continuing to learn. Um, the institution uh, will have to adapt and continue to adapt. And, and I think you've got, to, you've got to be looking over the horizon and, uh, and trying to anticipate what some of the impacts of the changes that are coming will be. Uh, and there will be changes. You know, it, it's not going to remain static. Um, I mean, just look at what's going on right now, the discussion with AI. And, uh, you know, how are we going to adapt that to enhance student learning? How are we gonna help people um, learn better, faster? Um, uh, you know, that, that's a real, I think, key element, is how are we going to adapt? We have to remain relevant in the discussion. Um, and, and that relevancy is gonna depend on how well we understand what's coming at us uh, in the future. And, and preparing to, uh, uh, adopt uh, new technology, to adopt new ways of thinking, new ways of doing things. Um, you know, the students that we, the, the expectation of students uh, and their families today is much different than they were even a few years ago. Uh, and that's normal, that's change, you know. Um, it impacts us all and it impacts higher education. Uh, even though we're an institution of higher education, um, we'll have to change and adapt.